Today I'm at the Castle Milk Youth Complex with Mari, the SNP's Youth Campaign Coordinator. This is the first election in which 16 and 17 year olds will have the right to vote and I'm immensely proud that it was an SNP government that led the way to deliver votes at 16, part of our proud record of empowering Scotland's young people and providing them with opportunities to thrive. In, in saying that, contrast that with what I'm seeing in Westminster. Since being elected a year ago, I've had a clear view of an out-of-date Tory government that is hammering young people, abolishing housing benefit for people under the age of 21, slashing support for students from deprived communities, and tuition fees up to nine grand. If we are re-elected, uh, I guarantee that we will protect free tuition and we'll expand support to students from low-income families as well. We'll use all of the powers at our disposal to further support our young people in everything they do. By introducing a new jobs grant for young people, we can help up to 6,000 young people every year get into and stay in work. We'll also deliver new opportunities in the world of work as well. We'll increase the number of modern apprenticeships to 30,000 a year by 2020. This and more is what we'll deliver for Scotland's young people. On the 5th of May, we have a chance, a real opportunity, to deliver a government into the Scottish Parliament that we know will stand up and protect the people of Scotland as best as possible. I would say, and I'm sure Nicola would agree, the best way to do that is for both votes SNP on the 5th of May.